All right, guys, here we go. Timmy review. I got my snood. I got my beanie. I got my Timu. Let's go. So I did a Timu review about a month ago. You guys really seem to like it. A lot of good debates about the quality of the product, whether or not you should buy from Timu. It was fun times. So I'm bringing you another review. Timu offers all kinds of products at affordable prices. Timu is giving me a 30% off discount code, which I will put up on the screen later in the video, but that discount code and a link to Timu is in the description box below. Last time I did mainly kitchen gadgets, things like that, and I've still been using those. Those utensils have been great. The rug is holding up well. I even have been using that strainer that adds onto the pot. So I've been pleasantly pleased with what I got in my last haul. Today's haul is a little bit different. I got a couple more cheap kitchen gadgets that I'm gonna share with you. I also wanted to try out some home decor. I didn't get a lot of that, but I got like a couple pieces and then I wanted to try out some of their fashion. So let's see what's in the bag. Last time I did the review, I was in my living room and that was comfy. I'm kind of staying in my kitchen now because I got things going and it's just, I got places to put stuff, so we're gonna try this. I think what I'm gonna do first is kinda unbag everything. I'm not gonna actually take it out of its package yet. I'm gonna kind of group it by category, and then we'll go to each category and actually open up the actual item and see what we think about the quality and the price. So, how this first bag, first thing that we've got is this. I think this is a little ice tray, ice balls. So that would go in kitchen. So I'll put that over there. And then in the same bag we have, ooh, this was something I was interested in. This is an egg chopper. It looks like, I might have two ways. So we'll put that in kitchen. Ooh. These are wooden beads. This is home decor. I'm really wanting to do something different on my front table. So we'll check these out in a minute. So home decor. So we've got kitchen so far, home decor. Oh, this is a hair clip. <laughs> you know me. We'll put that in beauty or fat, I don't know, beauty fashion. Let's see. Okay. This is a funnel. Collapsible funnel, kitchen items. Oh, and another collapsible funnel. Okay, kitchen items. So first bag is done. Okay, so fashion. Okay. This looks like a mini <clears throat> backpack. I'm interested to see what that's all about. I'm not gonna open it yet, fashion. Okay, last item in this bag. Looks like another fashion item. And this looks like it's some kind of a beanie. I don't know, but that's a lot of beanie. All right, I've been needing a new beanie, so we'll check that out, more fashion. Ooh, guys, I've been needing me a new ball cap. I love having ball caps because on the weekends when I have to go to the grocery store, I don't wanna fix my hair sometimes. And a home decor. This is a floral bouquet. It's not, I don't know. We're gonna wait until we completely open it. So that goes with the home decor. Oh, and I've been wanting to try these. Air fryer liners. Okay, so kitchen. This last bag is heavier. It's got a lot of boxes in it, so let's see. Okay, automatic magnetic stirring cup. I have no idea what this thing does. Okay, I don't know, we'll check that out. Kitchen item. A food chopper. 
Okay, so this is like a handheld, it looks like, food chopper. It's not like the one that does my like ch -ch 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 dicing thing. So I'm interested to see what this does. So a food chopper. So there's another kitchen item. I actually got more kitchen items than I thought I was getting. Okay, last item is Protect Fresh Box High Quality Stainless Steelware. It looks like it's a set of bowls, stainless steel containers, storage containers. Okay. All right. So the bags have been empty. So let's check out. Hmm. Let's start with this home decor. We'll start with the wooden beads. Okay. They are wooden beads. I mean, they look kind of like the look I was wanting. Hmm. So I wonder if I can do something in my front table with that. These were only like $2.50. I've never priced these out in the real world. I don't know. I don't know if that's a good price or not, but it's $2.50. And all the prices and links will be down below in the description box. So you can easily find these items. We have the wooden beads. And what I was wanting to do was... Pair that with this floral and put it in some type of a, a vase or something and work up my front table. But I'm kind of worried about this floral because it looks real like it's little. It's not a lot. It's not as big as I was thinking it was going to be. Let's see. It was $3.39. I could probably get that cheaper at Walmart or something. Um... I don't know, but I wanted to check it out. So let's unwrap this and see. Here's what it looks like. I mean, it's okay. So I think even Dollar Tree has like floral picks, but maybe I can do something with this at my front table, at my entryway. I don't know, we'll have to see. Okay, home decor. All right, next, let's get in to some of this kitchen stuff. I want to, I want to wait. I don't know. I really want to try out some of this fashion stuff, but maybe I will do some of the kitchen stuff first. I don't think that I need to really show you the, the air fryer liners. I mean, the air fryer liners. So I'm definitely going to be using those though. All right, so let's check out this egg chopper. This egg chopper, two-in-one egg chopper, it was $1.69. I mean, it, it's cheaply made, like the place, not heavy duty by any means. But you can see here, I could put my egg in here if I wanna wedge it. You just put this down and wedge and cut your egg. If I wanna slice my egg, it's got this that you lift and then you cut. So, not high quality, but for $1.69, I think it would be an interesting little gadget to have around. I'm going to keep that in this bag, though, because I don't want to lose the pieces to it. Because this one, this is attached. This is not. So, I'm going to keep it in a bag to keep it together. Okay, egg chopper. Neat little gadget. Next we have this egg, egg. Next we have this <clears throat> ice tray. Y'all know how I've been loving my Stanley Cup. I've been drinking ice water like crazy, but I like a lot of ice. So these though, this little tray, makes it into little ice balls. Isn't that cute? And then it just comes apart like that. So that's neat. That would also be neat if you were gonna be doing like some type of a party or a shower or something like that and you wanted cute little ice cubes. This was only $1.69. So that's cool. All right, let's check out these bowls. I don't know, 
<laughs> I like stainless steel stuff. Okay. So here we have the bowls. It's got a plastic lid. And of course, all the bowls are stacked inside each other, which is good for storage. All right. So we have two. How cute. Three. Four. Oh. And little baby five. <laughs> These stainless steel bowls, there are five sizes. They all come with the plastic lid and they also store inside each other. So this is a great option to save storage in your kitchen. So I think this was a really good deal. Okay, the next kitchen item that I'm gonna check out is really simple and it's really not anything that I was like thinking, oh my gosh, I need to look for that. But I do think it's gonna make storage so much easier. And that's these collapsible funnels. So my kitchen drawers stay packed. I mean, are you with me? Are your drawers as cluttered as ever? And like sometimes I'm like trying to open it and it's stuck or I'm trying to put something back and it won't fit and it won't close. I need to declutter a lot of that. This is a good idea. These are silicone, you got two sizes. So these collapse and therefore they're not gonna take up as much storage space. And I'm really excited about this baby one because of my salad dressing container. I have this itty bitty salad dressing container to take when we make pack salads, but it's really hard to get the dressing in that. This is perfect. Look for salad dressing. That could be a game changer. Maybe I won't make such a mess. These collapsible funnels are really easy, especially the small one, to fill small containers with dressing that you wanna take with you, or any kind of small container. And the great thing about this funnel it is collapsible, which is gonna save you room in your kitchen storage. Okay, I have two more kitchen gadgets to look at. I'm gonna look at this food chopper because y'all know if you've watched any of my video, well, not any of my videos, but if you've been around a while, I love my vegetable chopper. This one is handheld. So it's got more functions though. Whereas the other chopper just chops and dices. Um, I think it has a mandolin too. This one has a blade. You don't know if you can see that. A blade where I could do some um, kind of food processing chopping where I want, you know, I don't know. I don't know if that's the right word. Anyways, so it just comes apart like that. And there's several different attachments. Let's see. It looks like it's got a little slicing attachment. So also if you wanted to put the slicing attachment on and then do it like this, then it just, it, it just spits it out. Okay. And then we have this attachment, which looks like it's a, a peeler. It is chargeable. So. Hmm. I'm intrigued. I'm curious what the price on that is. The, this was $16.99. So one of the pricier items, but it's kind of interesting to me and it doesn't take up as much room as my other vegetable chopper. So you will probably definitely be seeing me try this out very soon. And the last thing is this automatic stirring cup. I don't even know, like, ooh, it's pretty. Okay, when you take the lid off, it has this little spinny thing in there. And I don't think it's charged because it's got this little button. I think that if you click that, it'll start spinning, but it's not spinning. So that's interesting. So I guess if you wanted to keep your like creamers and all that stirred up in there. And it's actually really pretty. It's actually more... Okay. Like you take the bottom off and it just takes those batteries. Looks like it's triple A. Hmm. 
I don't know how it says it's rechargeable, but because I don't see a cord there. It's twelve ninety nine. So I don't know. I don't know if that's worth it. Like I said, it's cute. I haven't got to install the batteries yet and try it out. But if you're someone who likes to keep your coffee and you like to keep it stirred up, or maybe your tea, then that might be something that you will be interested in. So that's all the kitchen gadgets. All right, the moment I've been waiting for. Let's check out some of this fashion stuff. Okay, here is the beanie. It was $7.64. It's, oh. It has one of these to keep your neck warm. It's called a, I'm sure y'all will tell me how to say this. I think it's a snood. Is it a snood or is it, <laughs> it goes around your neck to keep your neck warm. And when I'm sitting on the playground at school on a cold, windy day, that might be nice to have. All right, and then here is the beanie. It's cute. It's got a little label there, it says sport. It is lined, so that looks extra warm. So nothing's gonna get through this knit. Try it on. Here we go, guys. I got my snood. I got my beanie. Y'all kind of like this. It's like purple. But it's not like purple purple. It's kind of a, I don't know. I wouldn't call it ombre, it, but it's got some white kind of running through it. All right, so the beanie and my snood. Okay. I think that's pretty cool. That's gonna be handy when it's cold out. All right, let's see what else we have. Okay, here's the ball cap. Now, I am a ball cap gal. Even back in high school, I like to wear a ball cap. You know, not all the time, but like, you know, when you didn't want to fix the hair. So I needed a new ball cap because when I went to the beach last day, mm -hmm. but yeah, I got lots of hair, as y'all know. And sometimes ball caps are tricky because if they're not cut just right, all oh, this hair, man, it's not going up in the hat. So I was kind of, well, really interested to see how this turns out. Also, because when it's in shipping, sometimes the hats get mushed. But here we go. So here's the hat. It doesn't look mushed. Okay, it's white. It says forever. Feels pretty good quality. I mean, it really does. It's pretty thick here. And in the shipping, it did not get bent because they shipped it with plastic so that it would hold its shape. So there's a ball cap. Hmm. Y'all are probably be seeing these and this during some grocery hauls. So I don't have to fix this hair. <laughs> but I like the hat. Yeah, the hat was only $2.96. I mean, that's cheap for a ball cap. And this is actually pretty good quality. And it looks like the type of hat that I would definitely wear. It's also got this kind of back on it where you can like, you know, adjust the strap. Yes, I, I like that. That's a good one. All right, so we have this little bag. This is the women's mini print backpack. Okay, so it is, it's mini. I mean, you can see if I had it on my back, okay. It's brown with some gold accents. The backpack. You can see the inside. Has a front pocket. You can see that there. Okay. And then the strap. Let's see. This does have an adjustable strap. I don't have this completely adjusted yet. But you can see a cute little mini backpack. I'm all about wearing <clears throat> backpacks or coffee bags or a belt bag. I'm not a purse person, <laughs> but this mini print backpack is $5.99. It's not gonna hold a ton of stuff, but it will hold. It holds what I would carry around. 
All right, so that's the mini backpack. All right, guys, that is my Timu haul. I tried to give you my most honest review. I tried to look at a variety of things, not just kitchen related. And I think we got some really good items. I think we got some items that were kind of neat, cool little gadgets that I didn't think about needing that's gonna help me out with storage in my kitchen. And you are free to make your opinion as well because we all have different opinions and that is perfectly okay. Please don't forget, the link is down below. Timu is offering a discount code. I will put that up here for you. So if you click on the link down below, enter in the discount code, you will be getting 30% off of your order and all of the links to all the items that you see here are down in the description box below. If you haven't seen my first Timu review, I will have that video linked down below as well. It was mainly kitchen items in that one and that was a really big haul. So anyway, thanks for coming to my channel. I hope you liked this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up, y'all. Show me some love. Subscribe if you've not already thought of doing that. And guys, I'll see you in the next video. Bye.